Today we just want to start with a, a basic movement, first up anyway. Because um, people always come into the dojo or, or in, 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 in Aikido especially, and you see these very contrived looking movements called kion, basic movements. Not kion waza, but kion dosa. Um, and we spend years training these, and people often won't spend years training them because they mm. just don't see the application nor feel the yeah. inclination to continue with it. What do you think? Yeah, and they can actually be very frustrating in the beginning because your if thoughts are like, I'm doing this wrong, I can't do this. Um, what's the point? What's the point of these? Uh, I just want to throw someone. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, 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 yeah. You want to do the cool stuff? Yes. Yeah. Um, but again, this is part of the development, isn't it? That's right. I think it's that's the best part. I think if you can embrace for what the, feels like those horrible moments, you, you can really lay. It's just so beneficial later and, on. And later on, and, and don't get us wrong, we don't pretend to be experts. We're only imparting what we think at this point in time. Okay, but. I'm finding at this point in time, key, I'm coming back to Keon all the time because everything is in Keon. Mm. Even though at the beginning you're trying to just get it over and done with, um, to get to the cool stuff, now I'm finding more interest in just this stuff that looks boring yeah. than stuff that looks cool. Definitely. It's crazy. Yeah. Um, so one of these is called Hiriki no Yosei or elbow power. So we start from Kamai. And we'll talk more about Kamai in another time. Um, but from here, we just practice sliding forward and using our elbow. So it looks like, what the heck? Why are we doing this? What's the point? Yeah. But over hours and hours and years and years, you start to develop your center line. Um, and then it doesn't matter where they grab you. Like, for example, I can say, okay, now, don't, don't let me move. Hold me as hard as you can. Now, I can use strength and push it. Or I can just relax into it and move. Just from here. Doesn't matter how hard he pushes. Wow. Just here. Wow. Feel where his energy is, where his strength is. And don't go against it. Move it. Then it doesn't matter. Even moving this way. Then a half. Yeah. yeah. What are your thoughts? Yeah, I agree. I think it's uh, it's about uh, not. It's very common. I think very easy to clash, and you know, usually the stronger one wins. Thank you, Ryan. But what I love is that uh, basically, like Ryan was saying, is that uh, if their power is just here. You just find a different way to move it. So I'm just gonna hold. Now I'm pulling against him, so I don't know where he's going. Yeah, it's yeah, but, but we train with harmony to feel the okay. I mean, we then my training is also as okay. I want to feel where he's going, so I'm not just a bystander. In this. That's the beauty of training in Aikido. I get to learn to feel where he's directing. That's right, it's important to feel the technique as it is to give the technique. That's so important. Yeah. More important in some cases. Yeah, I've learned more from being Sensei Zuke than any of being staying doing it, right? Yeah, that's right. That's fantastic. That's right. Yeah. Beautiful.